Hey, I don't think I know you. I'm Claire. You might not remember me. Bartender at the Afterlife? Uh-oh. Forgot to close my tab? Bar has a buzz about you lately. As the bar who's reliable, gets things done. And since I need help... Okay. Need a driver for street races. Drop by my auto shop. I'll tell you more. You know, I think I'll pass. Well, shame that. Well, if you change your mind, swing by my garage in Valley. See ya. It's good you're here. What happened? Spit it out. The Wraiths took Saul. The Brick Brain ventured out with a small patrol and never came back. Sure it was Wraiths? 
We've been observing their camp. We know they're holding prisoners, including someone important. We need to free Saul. I don't know why, but I felt I could count on you. I could help you out. There's a butt attached to that. Not for free. I might have guessed. There never is anything free with you statics. Fine. I will give you one of the best sniper rifles on the west coast. A Tektronica Grad. You saw it in action already. All yours. Compliments of the Caldos. Sounds fancy. Once you have it in hand, fancy all of a sudden becomes kick-ass. Let's go. Mitch will walk you through the details. Well, I'll be. Pan Am and V, what's going on there? Him? After what happened to Scorpion, he shows up here? Guess probably for Saul. Ignore that. Hey, Pan Am, seriously? You really aim to do this? Someone has to. You know you have a piston missing, right? Someone has to. Where's Mitch? He was supposed to meet me here. He'll be here any minute. Huh. You never mentioned seeking outside help. We can use all the help we can get. Is there a problem? Just that if we're looking outside, we must be a hot mess inside. That's why we'll go in quiet. A frontal assault would be suicide. Mitch is already setting up recon. V will sneak into the Wraith's camp while I'll be his guardian rifle. Going in quiet. Two's all you need. It's not that I don't want to go to serve some raffins up some justice. It's just... Look around! The last attacks left barely half of us standing. Our supplies are stuck outside goddamn Reno, and our gear... Don't get me started. We're up shit creek. Static. And I don't know if we're... Your leader gets nabbed, and you, what, hope for the best? Rather than I think about what you do for the ones at the bottom of your food chain. You're asking for trouble. Leave it! He has a right not to understand. There's Mitch. I floated a drone over the Wraith's camp. Will you take a look, or would you rather keep mouthing off? Mitch, how you been? Wishing duct tape could right all the world's wrongs. And hey, it shouldn't be me occupying your thoughts, but Saul. You taking a look or not? Let's see what we got here. The Raffins can't see it. Active camo, but that practically inhales battery juice, so make it quick. They found an abandoned cement plant to squat in, with a mass of heavy gear. Locusts would be a better name for them. They fly into a place, strip it of all it's got, then move on. But this time... You see the wall? They've added some primitive security measures. It points to them aiming to stay longer. The question is why. Who knows for sure, but I would guess that Saul is part of the reason. If he's still there, we have to find a way inside. That guard post is probably connected to the rest of the camp. Our way in. Maybe, but there are also breaches in the wall. Lightly guarded sections. Do you see the tracks? Tire tracks. Their vehicles were moving heavy freight. It could have been equipment. 
Either that or Saul's not their only prisoner. The tracks lead to the truck. Can you scan it? That's probably the one they kept Saul in. The main building, there. Saul must be inside. Quite a spread. Feel like looking for a diamond in a hailstorm. If they haven't scrapped and gutted the place for parts, you could access the local camnet. You would just need to find the control room. Skywalk. It connects the garage to the main structure. Okay, got some stuff to work with now. Is everything clear? Yep. Let's go get Saul. Perfect. Mitch, is the van primed? I did what I could. Take a tour. Solid job. I mostly improvised, actually. Either way, it'll have to do. Hold on a minute, I got one more thing. If you find Saul hasn't flatlined, you'll probably need this. Spike Superjet, a rhino dose. It should speed up Saul's central pump. Hope so. Doubt I could carry him out of my back. So that should be everything. V. Will you ride with me? Yeah, of course I'm going with you. Okay, you take the wheel. One me driving. Yep, I need to fiddle with my scope a bit. For a spin, if you like. he let himself get captured. Anyone else? But Saul? Said yourself he's not at the top of his form. Yes, but moving civilians across the border during a bombardment? Hijacking a petrochem tanker? Opening the valves? Cranking a few figure eights to set the desert ablaze and give the kids a fun show? That's the Saul I remember. All that are idols. I know. It's just... One hell of a storm! Looking bad. Oh, it's bad in more than its look. We have to move quickly. We need to hide the car. Park beside that outcrop. Okay, out. I'll find a place to roost and keep you in sight. You just watch yourself down there.
All right, I'm in position. I have you in range. You're near the main structure. That has to be where they're holding Saul. somewhere inside. I feel it in my bones. Remember what I told you. Find the control room and you'll gain access to the security cams. Thank <laughs> you. 
That's all, I think. Locked in the cellar. How is he? It's hard to say. Too dark. Okay, get down there and get him. Maybe we made it in time. Yeah. 
Got a girl here. Dead. Disemboweled. And not just for her chrome, I don't think. Fucking Raffins. Solus built. There's no line they won't cross. None! On him. Is he breathing? I think so. Good. Grab him and get out of there. Saul. Do, do, 
So you have my goddamn cigar. Easy, Saul. I'm here with Pan Am. Pan Am? But she left. Not forever. Gonna get you out. You. I remember. You're that merc. Can you walk? Fuck! Something is out of whack. You're pretty badly beat. Probably could use this. Uh. Oh, yeah. So? How is he? Time to don my dancing shoes. He'll live. Now get yourselves out of there. Middle of a shitstorm down here. Bruin to be a Category 5. I know. Get out of the building. I'll be right there. Am, you're making a mistake. Another you're one. You're serious right now? Those devils wanted to know our location. If we drive to camp now, we'll just be setting the table for them. You look outside lately. The storm will wipe our tracks. And the scent of blood? What? We got more chomping at our tail. Fuck! Treat an engine. Fuck off, Saul. I can't squeeze any more out of it. Cut off that tail. Get ready. <laughs> you think to my ear. All the call dogs. Decommission the bastards! Go up road! This will be rough! Stark! It's gonna swallow us! We need to find shelter! I know, damn it! There's an abandoned farm nearby! I'll get us there! Fuck! My head! You up to kill me?
this onslaught down. <laughs> Here! Woo! We got him! Ha ha! way, girl! I couldn't have done it better myself! Uh, you see those buildings? We'll wait it out there. I remember this place. It should be safe, at least for now. Inside, quick! I need to catch my breath. Just in time for dinner. Not hungry. I just saw the sound of sand. Looks like we're in for the night. A little power might be useful. Could you help me look, V? I'll search in here. A lot of useful things. Angles left in a hurry. Hey, it worked! We have lights! Damn, it's getting cold. I tried to get us some heat in here, but no luck. Can you check it? Might have the magic touch. Actually, you know what? Check the fuse outside. It might have come loose. If so, just whack it back in place and I'll get this junk burning. See what I see? Expiration date's from before the last war, so hopefully it hasn't turned to poison. Today's our lucky day. Lucky? Interesting choice of words. Do I hear a lecture coming on? No. No lecture. But we do need to talk. That raid's crap. It shouldn't have happened. They wanted everything. Our camp locations, routes, offloading points. If they knew what state we're in, one or two more raids and that'd be the end of us. And if you had mounted a raid of your own, well, that would have been the end of me. <sighs> it's not the time for this. You're both exhausted. Maybe you're right. We can't hope to handle the Raffins alone. So you would sell us out to Biotechnica? Vade, tell him it's a damn rotten idea. Don't be mad, but I think Saul could be right. What? Why? You know how things work in Night City? You got everybody fighting for a slice of the street. If you keep getting jumped, you find some stronger Chumbas. You're talking about gangs. The principles are the same out here. You ought to remember that. Hear that, Pan Am? That is the voice of reason. All I hear is the fucking wind. We've had our spats. A few. Like any family. They're not worth digging up. I think so, too. If you'd like to come back, everyone will be waiting. Arms open wide. But there will have to be changes. 
No more jumping to the front of the line. And so it begins. You know what, sweetheart? We'll have plenty of time to tear at each other's throats later. That is my hope. But right now, I wouldn't mind catching a few winks. Need help? Fuck off. Huh. Do you know what they call these storms in North Africa? Haboobs. Damn, I love that word. Whoa, what was that about? To her boobs. Yeah. To her boobs. Ugh. Now that packs octane. And? You think this is any better? No. Just different. Yeah, this would make for a decent little motel, wouldn't it? Little fireplace, booze. Grumpy guy at reception is the one thing missing. Have everything you need, ma'am. Mm-hmm. I couldn't ask for more. What a day. Ma'am, I'm sure you'd be cozier with your shoes off. <laughs> After a full day in them, I'd fear a health code violation. Nonsense. After a day as full as today, you deserve to kick back. Oh? And what did you have in mind? Got a few ideas. Think you know what kind? Uh... <clears throat> the... No. It's really nice as is. Let's not spoil it, okay? I... I'm, I'm sorry. Didn't know what I was thinking. Oh, it's fine. Truly. Don't let it worry you. Right. So, friends, then. V, I'm glad you came. Really. Thanks. It meant a lot to me. Ooh, do you hear that? Nope. Hmm. Mm-hmm. The wind has waned. I can't speak for her boobs, but when a Chinook rolls rough and rowdy across the plain, I sure can't get any, should I? Not a wink. On behalf of the staff of the Independent California Motel, I wish you all sweet dreams.